Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Lucy Cespedes and today I wanted to film a quick short video um, answering 30 questions that would help you guys get to know me a little better. So um, let's get to it. I screenshot some questions here on my phone just to help me, um, you know, get through it a little faster. So, no, oh and if you hear baby noises in the back, I have my daughter back there in the high chair watching a movie and um, she might get wild so let's do this okay number one are you named after anyone um, no I'm not number two when was the last time you cried uh, the last time I cried was two nights ago um, my daughter out of nowhere in the middle of the night she woke up because she wanted to have some milk and she, well, I was I went to fix her milk and I came back and she was clapping just clapping over and over back and forth um, Like a crazy person and she for the past two days. She's been clapping all day long She does not want to stop and I absolutely love that. I actually started crying that night because I thought it was the cutest thing ever Number three, do you have kids? I sure as hell do I have a little girl her name is Emma Elizabeth and she is seven months old number four if you were another person, would you be a friend of yourself? Um, I think I would be. I only have one good close friend. Her name is Amelia. Hey, girl. And um, I think I'm a pretty good friend to her. I mean, she might think different, but whatever. I think I'm a pretty good friend to her. I do everything that I can to um, make her happy. And uh, we hang out a lot. Yeah, we hang out a lot. And we always have fun. And yeah, I think, I think I would be a good friend. Number five, do you use sarcasm a lot? <sighs> Never. Number six, <laughs> what's the first thing you notice about people? Um, okay, I guess it means whenever you meet someone. So the first thing I notice when I meet somebody, it's just the way they act towards other people and how they speak of other people. Like if I meet, if I just met you and you're talking crap about someone else, um, I already assume in my brain that you're gonna do the same thing as soon as uh, you know I'm not around so yeah that's what I notice about people that's when you know people are shady and fake number seven what is your eye color um, my color it's like a dark brown sometimes it looks straight up black whenever I wear eyeliner and have lashes and you know everything number eight scary movie or happy endings um, I would say happy ending. I would watch a scary movie if it's like the middle of the day and I, I'm around other people. Um, happy movies, happy endings, uh, I love it. Or comedies, even cartoons I can watch. It's just not scary movies because I get scared. Uh, number nine, favorite smell. Uh, my favorite, I have a couple. I'd say I like clean laundry. I love lavender. Um, I like lavender all year round for my home except for the Christmas time. Christmas time I love the fresh pine smell. Uh, it just smells like a Christmas tree in my apartment and I love it. Um, number 10, what is the farthest you've ever been from home? So I'm originally from Cuba so I guess if I were considering that my home it would be here in the US. And But since I live now here in the US the farther I've been from my home here in Kentucky it's in Toronto, Canada. Number 11, do you have any special talents? Um, I played the violin for a few years when I was in school. I don't anymore, I wish I kept doing it, but um, I guess that's a special talent. Um, number 12, where were you born? I was born in Bayamo, Cuba, but as people say here in the US, Cuba. Um, number 13, what are your hobbies? Um, I love to sew. I, I make car seat covers, baby blankets, uh, all kinds of baby items. And um, I also like, I love photography. That's like a passion of mine. It's my full time job, is where I get all my income, the majority of my income from. And um, it's photography. And I absolutely love it. I don't even, I don't even see it as a job. I see it more as a hobby. Um, Number 14, do you have any pets? Um, I do have a dog, her name is Luna, and she's a German Shepherd. Okay, number 15, do you have any siblings? Um, I sure do, I have one sister, her name is Leanne, hey girl, and she is 14 years old, and she's gorgeous. Uh, number 16, what do you want to be, 
what do you want to be when you oh so it's number 16 but I cut it off so I can't finish reading the question so let's move on to 17 number 17 who was your first best friend? I can't remember her name, but I remember being really, really, really close friends with this girl. I think her name is like Dariangni or something. Yeah, I think it's Dariangni. I was like this with her. We were thick as thieves, and um, we were such good friends back in Cuba. Uh, number 18, how tall are you? <laughs> I am five foot of joy. Number 19, funniest moment throughout school. Um, skipping school, as bad as it is, that was one of my uh, favorite memories uh, junior year when I skipped school with my friend Eileen. Uh, she lives in Tampa now, but um, we had we had a blast. We had a blast. Don't skip school. Number 20. How many countries have you visited? Uh, well, I guess let's put Cuba in there because I've been back since I moved here 11 years ago. Um, the US, uh, Canada, I think that's it. Yeah, three countries. Um, what was your favorite slash worst subject in high school? My favorite, favorite subject in high school was math. Was math. Even though I had a hard time understanding, I absolutely loved my teacher and especially my senior year. The teacher I had my senior year. Um, I asked Miss Lister, shout out to you. Uh, she definitely made me love math. I loved her class. And um, my worst subject in school, I was I would have to say science. Everything was always, especially when we had to work in the lab and write down formulas and stuff, everything was so complicated to me. Like my brain could not make sense of it. Number 22, um, what is your favorite drink, animal, perfume? Okay. My favorite drink, like alcohol drink, it's um, strawberry dye cream. Um, my favorite animal, I guess I would say dogs. I've always had a dog growing up and I love them. And my favorite perfume is uh, Bombshell from Victoria's Secret. Love it. Okay, number 23. What would you or have you name your children? I named my daughter Emma Elizabeth. I absolutely love that name. I wanted to name her Skyla, but um, my parents, my Cuban parents, my Cuban parents, that's the only parents I have. My parents uh, would say Skylar instead of Skylar, like they would add an A at the end and E, and um, I just went with Emma. And that was my sister's idea, the name Emma, and I loved it when she said it, so we went with that, Emma Elizabeth. Number 24. What sports do you play or have you played? Um, I play soccer and I love to play baseball. Number 25. Who are some of your favorite YouTubers? Okay, my absolute favorite YouTuber of all time is Erin Williams. Hey. Um, I watched her uh, for quite a while now. I ran into her videos um, when I was pregnant with my daughter and I was looking up pregnancy updates just to compare what was going on with me. Uh, with other moms out there and I ran into her 20 weeks video when she was pregnant with baby Skyla hence that's why I wanted to name my daughter Skyla um, and she's pregnant right now with her second baby so I'm excited to see uh, baby Adeline okay um, number 26 how how many boyfriends dash girlfriends have you had I have no clue uh, 27 Favorite memory from childhood? Um, I would have to say going to the river when I lived back in Cuba. Me and my friends would go to the river all the time after school and uh, we had a great time. Uh, yeah. Uh, number 28, how would you describe your fashion sense? I would say mom, <laughs> very comfortable but stylish. Like. Some days I wake up and I wear yoga pants and a sweatshirt all day and tennis shoes. And some other days you will see me wearing some nice jeans, like rolled up on the bottom a little bit. Some nice nude heels and a nice shirt. So, I guess a little bit of everything. Very casual though. Very casual. Okay, number 29. What phone do you have? I have the iPhone uh, 6S Plus. I have not upgraded. I've had this phone for a couple years now, I think. Um, yeah, 
And I'm not planning to upgrade anytime soon because it was like almost a thousand dollars. It was crazy expensive. Um, and it says iOS or Android with the twin, you know, after the question for the phone. Um, I would say iPhones, but it's been disappointing me a lot lately. Maybe it's because my phone is almost two years old. But, um, like, sometimes I don't know where it's, the battery it's like 34% and it just completely, sh the phone shuts off. And it will come on back to life like 10 minutes later. Like, uh, anywho. Number 30. Tell us, um, one of your bad habits. Uh, one of my bad habits is not getting stuff done. Especially now that I'm a mom, like, I thought it was bad when I had it before I had the baby. Now it's really, really bad. Like, um, I would, I'm the kind of person now that I've got to the point where I have to make a list of everything I need done. Otherwise, it will not get done. Uh, and that includes making doctor's appointments. That includes absolutely everything. Even doing dishes, I have to write, like, a list for everything. Okay, well, let's wrap this video up. Uh, that was my 30 questions so you guys could get to know me a little better. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video if you haven't already. Um, I think you need to hit the notification button to be notified when I upload videos. I would really, really, really appreciate that. Thank you guys so much for opening this up and I'll see you on my next one. Goodbye.